Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's tutorial I'm going to reply to a comment from my most watched video so far and thank you all for commenting and interacting with my content which makes my channel show up for other people searching for similar content and I will probably link the video in the right corner for you. Before we start with today's tutorial I just want to let you know that I'm selling a Wix Studio template and I, it's submitted for the Wix Studio marketplace until it it is accepted and approved in the marketplace you can buy it on payhip and you can find the link in the description it's an online store for business owners who want to start selling and just customize the template because they find it faster and the ux is already infused into the template you just have to use your own imagery copywriting and of course other branding details that you want to implement in the website the template is very minimalistic, it's very sleek and professional, it gives off also the vibe of luxury. And if you're interested in such a template, make sure to check the link below, UX included. Now, let's start with the video. Okay, in the previous video that I created about this uh, marquee infinite carousel, the question was how can I do this with gallery from Wix Studio? So what we are going to do, since this is a sandbox website, I'm just looking for a space where we can add a gallery. This one, it's not a gallery, I think it's a single image. Let's check the layers just in case. Yeah, it's a single image. Okay, perfect. Let's add here a section. For now, we're gonna use it as a blank section. Here we can also choose a design section, grid layout and adding element let's check what they have here i think here they will offer us different types of pre-designed sections as we know we have product services about banners clients do we maybe have this is different types of uh, products but not really a gallery okay anyway let's add an element and let's look for media and let's look for specifically pro galleries. Okay, we have a single images that they can look like this. Then we have pro galleries where they have some kind of layout. We have this one here that might be doing similar um, behavior as the infinite marquee. And this one, I think maybe we can add couple of them and just try to adjust the animations so let's start top to bottom and first try out this one and see how to rotate how it will look like on this one this is the first time i'm going to try this on the pro galleries and this is the thing that comes to mind that we can do with that i'm going to stretch it fully since the whole website has that similar vibe so as i was looking for the settings i found it here in design layout presets custom customize layout manual fix okay the crop responsiveness okay loop images slide automatically intervals continuous Slideshow speed 50, probably milliseconds. Pause on hover, spacing 32. Let's test it out. When we are going down, we can see that the images are sliding automatically. And when on hover, they pause and zoom in because that's the interaction that we gave. Let's see what else can we do with this. Layout, customize layout, intervals, time between images, let's see two, pause and hover, sure, spacing the same, slide automatically, okay. So let's test it out. When I scroll, I'm trying not to hover on the images, so each four images can get a second and then they can slide to the next one as i uh, set it up so far and this is how you can create the gallery to auto slide 
itself let's add another gallery and see i think i will add the single image gallery which takes the most uh, of the space in the section this one and then also we'll look for a little bit of padding at least on the top perfect settings a layout customized layout loop images sets automa slide automatically continues let's make let's leave it 50 and let's test it out The trick is that you shouldn't have uh, your mouse on hover because I believe it stops animation. So make sure you're away from the section itself. So it can count down and slide the images. But you can also opt out from the hover interaction and just leave it as it is. And yeah, that's how you make your galleries slide automatically without hovering on them. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below if you have any suggestions for other Wix Studio tutorials and if you enjoyed this video make sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment so we can tell the algorithm that my channel is still active. Hope you liked it and see you in the next one. Bye!